Five questions to an expert. Paul Mayo, Product Marketing Manager, quizzed on why it's necessary to fit the right steam trap for your application. Why are steam traps important? Steam traps remove condensate while keeping live steam in the system. Getting the right steam trap for the application ensures the highest productivity and energy efficiency. What are the most common types of trap? Thermostatic steam traps operate by using the temperature difference between steam and condensate. These traps are great for applications such as trace heating and small steam heating packages. Here's a mechanical trap that works on density difference. These include float traps and inverted bucket traps. They are used for heat exchangers, separators and for any other application where maximum heat transfer is required. Thermodynamic traps use the velocity difference between steam and condensate to control opening and closing. They are widely used for steam mains drainage. How do steam operators choose the right trap? Picking the right steam trap for the job is not always straightforward and it really is worth seeking advice. It depends on the application. If there is a lot of starting and stopping, then a thermostatic steam trap would be the good choice. On the other hand, an application with varying loads is best served with a mechanical trap because it responds quickly to changing loads. Is there a universal steam trap for all applications? Not really. There are orifice traps that do claim to be universal, but they're only really suitable for steady state applications. The trouble is the majority of applications all have varying loads, so it's impossible to find one steam trap that suits all applications. What else do I need to consider? It may seem obvious, but steam traps do need to be fitted correctly. Incredibly, some of our survey engineers find steam traps fitted upside down. And there are other installation rules, like ensuring that the steam trap is fitted below the condensate outlet. It's also a good idea to fit traps using a trapping station, like this STS-17, to simplify maintenance. Finally, a regular steam trap survey is a really good idea to make sure all your steam traps are working correctly. <laughs>